Hi everyone, this is Miss Vance. I have your assignment here for this Wednesday. You are going on a virtual vacation, so that should be exciting. Um, I hope you all are ready for this one. Um, you're going to start off again with another Flipgrid for me. Um, so you're gonna head on over to Flipgrid and complete the assignment about where you would rather be right now. Um, so, <clears throat> It says, take a minute to picture your favorite location, beach, mountains, lake, park, forest, ocean, um, trees, whatever. Um, describe it or hold up a picture and tell us what makes it special for you. So think about that and tell me, um, tell the class where it is you would rather be. Um, so that way you can um, just think for a moment, step back and be like, okay, I'm not here. I'm somewhere else. Um so next you're going to describe your dream vacation. Um, where in the world do you want to go and why? And what's so interesting about this place? And tell us all about it. So um, what is your favorite location? That's one thing. Second thing, dream location. Okay. They might be the same place, um, but they might not. Okay. I can tell you that my dream location is not my favorite location. Okay. Um... And then you're going to do a virtual vacation country report. Um, so, oh, before you do your country report, please make sure that you go to go back to Canvas and do a text box entry telling me that you have finished. So that way I can give you your credit for doing your flip grid. Okay, so don't forget that. All right. Thank you. All right. Um, virtual vacation country report. So you're going to go on a virtual vacation um, to a place that speaks Spanish. You're going to choose a place from the list below. Here's our list. Argentina, Costa Rica, Equatorial Guinea, Honduras, Bolivia, Cuba, El Salvador, Mexico, Chile, the Dominican Republic, Guatemala, Nicaragua, Colombia, Ecuador, Guam, Panama, Peru, Spain, Puerto Rico, uh, Uruguay, Venezuela, and the Philippines. So those are our places in the world, on the globe, um, that speak Spanish. Okay? Um, and these are your instructions. And you're going to find out the uh, following information. Okay? Put it in a document. Tell me all about this. Okay? Um, where is this place located on the, in the world? So... Northern Hemisphere, Southern Hemisphere, um, is it an island? Just tell me a little bit about this place. Um, is it on a continent? Things like that, okay? Uh, what's the capital of this place? What's the population? How many people live there? What's the size in square miles? What does the flag look like? Um, who are two famous people? Um, they could be celebrities. They could be politicians. They could be someone else famous. Um, maybe they won a Nobel Prize for something, Okay. Uh, what are two important products? Are they imports? Are they exports? Are they one of each? Um, what are two typical dishes? Food. Everybody loves food. Okay. And what are two tourist attractions? Why are we going to this place? Okay. So uh, you'll create your document and um, give me that. And, and always in your documents, make sure you're telling me this it, place, or okay? Because um, getting a lot of like the music and the art without telling me who the person is. So if I'm going to go there, I want to know what place am I visiting, okay? Um, and then pretend in your mind you've been. Now you're coming back. You're sending something back. Send us a postcard, okay? So now that you've gone on your virtual vacation... Hashtag virtual vacation um, and discovered plenty of information about your country. It's time to send home a postcard from your country. So you're going to create and design a postcard from your country. Make sure that you include a design on the front that proves you went to that country. So you're going to like, you know how you, when you look at a country, it always is like um, greetings from Milwaukee or um, Statue of Liberty sending you lots of love and things like that um, and then on the back. Is where you actually do your like, oh my god, we went to the Golden Gate Bridge, and things like that. That's in San Francisco, not not those two places I mentioned earlier. Um, so that you write your things proving that you went to that country. So the information that you found in your country report 
is going to be valuable for you in your postcard, okay? On the front and the back, all right? Um, so make sure you include a design on the front. So you're, it's going to be like two things, front of your coat postcard, back of your postcard. Um, make sure you include a design on the front that proves you went, and on, then on the back, be sure to write about what a great time you had. Write about the things you did, the food that you ate, the places you visited, how it's similar and or different from home. Okay. Um, make sure you give it a stamp so that way it gets back home. You can make it by hand or you can make a digital postcard. And I included a link to a digital postcard that I created. I went on a virtual vacation to a place. And so um, I like went and looked up all sorts of things. And I was like, oh, here's this blah, 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 blah. And um, created a, an, a replica of what it could look like. Um, and uploaded a version for you okay so that's your Wednesday assignment enjoy this one may take you a little longer just because there's a little bit more information to look up so um maybe a little bit more time and effort in on this one okay so let me know if you have questions and I hope you enjoy this one all right love you guys bye